moment for us to set it down. It's first anniversary with you. Uh, so what we are going to do is, first we'll just talk through our one year in just 15 minutes. Then we will go through some our milestones for the future. And then we will have a quiz. We'll just split into teams and there are prizes for that. Uh, it's a bit funny quiz. So, yeah. you, you'll be divided into teams, so don't yes. worry. You will have your team. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So, for those who don't know us, I'm Aditya, she's Rani, and that's our company, Adi Rani. And today we have like literally completed one year. Mm. It's today, like yes. literally today. <laughs> <laughs> so, for this, uh, we have something to share and also some new news that we want to like. It's actually expected something, but we'll just share with you guys. So, let's begin. Yeah. Okay, so first we'd like to thank you each and everyone individually. So I'm going to start, like, there are some people who are not here or invited, but from them, like, they have played a very huge role, like our families, our mentors, so thanks to them. Then thanks to Rory mm -hmm. for being a great friend and also bringing up Tech Lunch to what it is today. Then thanks to Felicity for being a very good, uh, you could say more than a friend. I always be open for whatever things we come to you for. So thank you very much for that. Uh, Rutuja for being a very nice friend. And of course the coffee van. Like <laughs> every time whenever we take a break, there's something we can disturb freely. So thanks Andrew and Josh. And also Anna. We know you for like a couple of years, Nathan. So thanks for being giving good insights for Galchi as well. Uh, and also be part of our journey. Sorry. Hey. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Rather, uh, like, we don't know each other, James, but I would like to thank you for and your team. <laughs> because uh, oh, from day one of our tech lunch, Relative Insight have been like a very crucial part of our event. Uh, literally, like, I would say 90% of the crowd is Relative Insight. It's not. I have all the facts. In the beginning. In the beginning. Yeah, yeah. Beginning, yeah. No, absolutely. It's okay. <laughs> yeah, but well, thank you guys for playing the role in picking it up. Thank you very, very much, Josh. Yes. Yes. For the pilot as well. Thank you for tomorrow. You're going to go talk. <laughs> <laughs> so, and yes, we cannot miss you guys. Niranjan uh, and Buddha, who is our teammate, uh, they are actually like a base of our company. So, thank you very, very much. <laughs> yes. Yes. <laughs> see, see how dedicated she is, she's actually working in the middle of all of this. But yeah. Yes. So yeah. Okay. So these are a couple of achievements that we have got. Like in last year we won an award for trading company of the year. So we have another company Gertrude, which is three years old. Uh, this one is one year old. And we were also finalists for Great British Entrepreneur Awards in the Foreign Innovation category. And this thing was a bit uh, unexpected because we thought, like, we, we just applied and nominated each other. We thought, okay, it will just happen, happen, like, because it's a tough competition. But somehow we got there. And, like, don't go to belittle us, but I was personally surprised, like, how are we here? <laughs> okay, we are here, that's great. So, yeah, we are at something to that. Yeah, I mean, we didn't exactly win, but being just being shortlisted for this British, I think like that that's already an achievement mm -hmm. uh, at least for this year. So I'm happy. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> you too. <laughs> okay. Okay. Yeah, but that's just uh, what has been happening this past year. But even though it says Garchi International, but anyway, it's just us. It's just a different company anyway, but still us. Yes. We are counting in it. So, it's been a year and like the stats are some, like, I guess the first one says about the companies we work with. So, just to give uh, like a, like just a short story how this Adirani started. So, it literally started like just on a table, on, on an evening tea table that me and Rani were discussing like, okay, I was doing freelancing myself, uh, like uh, along with uh, handling Garchi. And in that, we thought like it's necessary to have something, not just to get as a freelancing service, but come up with something like a digital doctors. 
So I just told Rani, like, why not we start a company? And then we went to Gov.uk website, uh, company's house, registered our company, and straight away, okay, there is Adi Rani. <laughs> and the name was struck, like, we were struggling with names. So before that, like, it started a year before, or like, a year before now, which is 2019. So a couple of years before now, where I used to ask people randomly, like, how do you think about this? What do you think about this concept? And uh, if Nathan remembers, like in the work in progress session, we were discussing about the name, what to come up with, and they said, why not you just put your own name? So we thought like putting like Aditya Maharani is kind of like a big name. <laughs> <laughs> people will either get tired pronouncing it or they will just say no to us. So we just cut short our name and came up with Adirani. So we served 15 startups, uh, mostly in UK, some in India, some in US, uh, mostly dealing in the, some are in AI, some are in e-commerce, but mostly they are in like, mix of AI and e-commerce. Uh, I have my own YouTube channel, if you know, so we also run boot camps under this Adirani. So 10 boot camps ran for programming, 100 candidates and students. Apart from those boot camps, I have personally mentored, mostly from Australian universities, UK, uh, Lancaster universities, and some from London, some from India, a couple of from US, so they're widely spread. Uh, I wanted to contribute to open source libraries, so we created three libraries. One is new tailwind package, which is just a style component, React tailwind package, the same thing, and a score predictor, which is, oops, <laughs> which is our, okay, uh, I said oops, we'll come to know once we start the quiz. It's okay, we can yeah. talk about it a bit. Yes, yeah. so it's an app that helps you uh, analyze your digital score of your business, which you've tried already. Yeah, yeah. and tech talks. Along, apart from tech, tech lunch, we also did some tech talks. So, in total, there are around 50 tech to business talks, including tech lunch. This is somewhere around 60s or 75. So, I just consider tech lunch talks for mine. <laughs> but if, other, if I consider yours and everyone else goes to more than that. And it's been since last year, wasn't it? Yes. And it's not even a tech lunch yet? Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. yeah. Yes. So, yeah. Quite a good number. <laughs> <laughs> For first year? Yes. And this is what we look for us. Like, so we had a, we had a product which is Gurji CMS, which is a headless CMS SaaS, which was a beta. So today we thought of making it as a stable version. And making it as a stable release, so we'll be releasing it in front of you guys. And what we are trying to now for mid-July is having a SaaS marketplace where companies can have their SaaS listed and like something like App Store for SaaS. So, well, the tech lunch helped a lot because there are some companies from Seattle and uh, Israel. They approached us, we asked them, how did you know about our company? And they said, like, you're here in a tech talk section known as tech lunch, somehow on Google Dress, so that's mm -hmm. great, thank you. So, getting all their SaaS and making a marketplace for them, also making this boot camps of programming more of a official thing rather than me individually doing it and making it under a company as a digital skills development. Last but not the least, like this uh, is a bit optimistic, but we want to get showcased in Web Summit, which is in November 2020. So we planned for 2022, but somehow it didn't work out. So we planned for 2023. We want to showcase our product as like a legit. Uh, business product rather than just going there as an attendee. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you want to add something? Uh, no, really. I mean, you, you pretty much uh, <laughs> cover all of that. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Uh, you want to launch now, don't you? Yes. Yeah. So, I'll come there. Okay. Yeah. So give me a moment. And what I'm going to do is first, yes. <laughs> Have you ever seen like a real product actually being launched in front of you like this. <laughs> but yeah, that's what we're trying to do. Launch. It goes on GitHub. It takes a couple of minutes to sync with the pipeline and everything, and then we'll just visit the website, which will, if you have seen it, it had a beta tag. If that beta tag is gone, then it's gone. That's like a stable release up there. So. Let's give a good couple of minutes till then. 
let's chit chat. <laughs> Something like that. You're pushing your master. You're pushing yes. your master. Yes. <laughs> oh, <man. laughs> well, uh, just, it just bit of nervousness. I just like to come and say. What's the PR? So it yes. just, it's your delivery process. You know what it highlights. For for people who are new, who are just joining us, like we are we're, we're launching our Garchi CMS finally officially, yep. and it's a headless CMS. It is a SaaS product as well. You will know why I'm talking like this because it's gonna come in handy for later. Um, uh, yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. These all things that we are gonna talk. If you listen it properly, it will lead you to this. <laughs> <Sorry>. <laughs> okay, uh, let's things cross. Let's see. Uh, okay. Uh -huh. Right. For a moment, I'll just turn off my screen. Get it back. <laughs> Confidential <laughs> information. <laughs> and I assume you're going to be able to make that screen work again. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah. I'm going to process it. So. Uh, Ready? Is this screen Yes. <laughs> You'll see, right? Uh, and it's gonna be fine. Oh, no signal. Then we got to this. Okay. Three, two, one. I told you not to disconnect. <laughs> Yay! So, there we have. So, Yes. And yes, it yeah. did. Mm -hmm. Awesome. Yeah. So this was previously in beta, so we came up with this all like we've been working on this for around half a year. Yeah. But actually working on this for around one and a half year. And it's been like a quite long journey because uh, there are some people who are not here who are our interns, uh, who are our uh, like friends who also contributed in it. So, like, it's not just us, but there are people behind it also, like their efforts and their hard work. So, and we've been through lots of pivots as well. Yes. yes. So we were also nominated by someone for an award, the most pivoted business award. So yeah. So it's for businesses who pivoted a lot and still and still sustain and came up with something as a robust product. So yeah. So yeah. around seven pivots in the last three years. Because this started as a homemade food delivery platform and now it is a SaaS business. Because, uh, yes, due to some reasons. I think we want to talk a bit on the headless CMS nature itself, like just a briefly. Like, it does. So, how is this different from the normal CMS, the traditional monolithic one? What CMS? Uh, content management system. So, okay, so. Let's say your drone thing. If I'm happy, like you, okay, just. I, if, if you're, if I'm, can I speak on it? Okay. Okay. So in that drone thing, when you have to create your map, you can either code it, or you have a handy tool to do it. So consider that handy tool as a content management system. Ah, okay. With drag and drops, you do it, and then you have an API just connects with it, and that makes it headless. Yeah. So the key point here is that it's not limiting you to one certain structure, but it's allowing you to be flexible using APIs as well. I'm being very focal. <laughs> yes, so, yes, that's all we wanted to share with you guys. 